everybody welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new i'm stephanie stay at home wife and homeschooling mama of four and today's video is gonna be probably just like a day in the life i don't really know we'll just see how it goes i am not gonna put no makeup on today and i'm not gonna fix this hair today because we have no plans we have schoolwork we've got to get done we have a cleaning list that needs to get done this weekend is my son's 15th birthday. He will be turning 15 on Saturday. So I've got a list of stuff that I'm gonna show y'all and I've gotta get this stuff knocked out. So there may be a little bit of cleaning in this video. I have no idea. We'll just say, you'll just have to go along with me and see what it is. And today we are gonna be manning the fort because daddy had to travel for work. He will be gone overnight and he will be back home sometime late tomorrow evening. He doesn't have to do that very often and today is one of those days that he had to and which we pretty much hold down the fort anyway because <laughs> me and these kids do all the feeding because of where he has to work he has to travel um 220 miles a day just to go to and from work which is a lot and it is crazy but he does it, and he does it because he wants to be back home with his family of an evening. Which I'm very thankful for that. So, usually we hold down the fort anyway. But it's just, we like having Daddy at home at night. It kind of scares us. If he's not home at night, we're used to having him here. And I see some rakes that need to go back to the barn because it's the horse stall cleaning rakes and i don't have a clue why they are on my back porch i take it some kids were probably cleaning the trailer out from this weekend and they didn't want to walk it back to the barn but anyway we're gonna hold this fort down and get all these critters fed this afternoon they've already fed for the day or for the morning and we'll have to feed again of the evening because we have some horses stalled in the barn they have to be fed twice a day and the kids usually take care of that because that is their horses and their their responsibility and they take pride in that responsibility and they love doing it even though sometimes they don't really want to crawl out of the bed that early of a morning and feed but they know that the critters need to be fed usually they get fed the critters get fed before the kids get fed which usually when they're out feeding i'm out or i'm in the house making their breakfast so they can eat as soon as they get back in and get cleaned back up but just go along with us today and we'll see how this day goes. And we're supposed to have some storms rolling in, so that makes it super bad. I don't really like being here by myself when it storms and the wind is already blowing. And I'm hoping that you can hear me because the wind's blowing pretty rough right now. And I see some dark clouds rolling in that I don't like the looks of them. So mama might have to clean the closet out again so we can go hide. All right, just go along with us. Well, here is my cleaning list that I was telling you about. This has to be done before the weekend. Well, the wind's blowing it away. And the kids is screaming in the house. They're supposed to be doing their work. They can do by themselves, but they're not. Anyways, I'm going to get the half bath cleaned. Clean the master bathroom. Clean the master bedroom. Dust the living room. Sweep vacuum mop the living room. Clean the doors and the door windows clean up the kitchen sweep and mop the kitchen clean off the stairs and vacuum the stairs the girls bedroom needs to be <clears throat> there's a few little toys that needs to be put away but it needs to be dusted and vacuumed clean the upstairs bathroom usually my girls take care of that for me i'm gonna have to talk them into taking care of it again because <laughs> mama got a lot she gotta do I gotta sweep and clean off the porches, sweep and clean off the carport, and get caught up on this massive pile of laundry that I have. These girlies are supposed to have been doing schoolwork. Mm -hmm. I meant my sandwich. <coughs> Say, so, so she needed a sandwich. We got started really late today. It's We're trying to get 10.39. Trying to get daddy packed up and headed out. He's gotta go stay in the hotel. So I had to hurry up and get, I had to iron his clothes and all that, so. Apartment. What are you? No, it's not an apartment. It's a hotel. <laughs> you need to finish up your history test, okay? Shaler okay. is upstairs doing her work. She can do it by herself. Oh, is that E? Are you okay? Is that E? No choking. I don't, I don't need nobody choking. 
you got, it's an open book test, so you got the book. Look your answers up. And Kaden is went with his papa. They are building a, oh, goodness. You need a drink? They are building a, a dog pen. They got them some little beagles this weekend. Beagles. Well, they're beagles. Beagles. So he's already finished most of his work. I've got to help him with his algebra when he gets home. They're called beetles. No, they're not. They're, they're beetles. beetles. They're beetles. <laughs> oh, they're, they're beetles. <laughs> Whatever. All right, y'all. Here's our supper. We decided to eat tighter wedges. And yes, I'm eating off of a Santa Claus plate. We just thought it was weird because I got ketchup. Kaden has barbecue sauce. Paisley has honey mustard sauce. Charlotte doesn't have anything to dip hers in, and then Sage has ranch sauce or ranch dressing. All of all five of us got something different to dip it in. We thought it was funny. <laughs> all right, y'all. We didn't do much after uh, we ate supper. I did a few more loads of laundry, and that was about it. And now I got a huge dog out here on my deck. Dale, get off the deck. Thank you. He listens very well. He's very tender-hearted. If you raise your voice at him, it hurts his feelings, and he goes and pouts about it. So he's going to pout right now. <laughs> you know, I didn't even yell at him. Sugar, no. And sugar, it doesn't even bother. Someone left the gate door o or the gate on the deck open, and now the big dogs are trying to get on my deck. Anyway, we survived with Daddy not being here last night. I didn't like it because I did not sleep well. I guess y'all can tell. I was up most of the night. Because you know, when you don't have your person there with you, that every little sound is a booger. And it's going to come get you. So every little creak, every little kid moving in their bed upstairs, I was like, somebody's in here. But it wasn't. We survived. We did have a horse escape again. <laughs> I don't know what the deal is. I think during the storm, the big loud, there was like a huge flash of lightning that hit right here behind our house, which would have been by the barn. And I think it scared him and he kicked his gate open to his stall, broke the lock off of the gate and he escaped. It was Schaller's barrel horse. But when we got out there, we knew the dogs was having a fit for some reason. They always tattletale. Um, we got out there. Schaller got out there, and her barrel horse was out in the barn eating hay. He hadn't bothered anything. He was just eating some hay. Like he doesn't get fed at all. But he was okay. The gate was broke. Uh, Caden fixed it, so he was he got put back up in his stall. They haven't been out there this morning, so. But the dogs haven't been pitching a fit this morning, so I guess everything's still okay. But anyway, we held the fort down. We did good. We got all of our business done. I didn't get nowhere near the amount of cleaning done that I wanted to get done. And here comes Sage out for the first thing this morning. And it's cold outside. She's got shorts on, so she's probably going to freeze. All right. Sorry to leave y'all hanging. I had a phone call I had to take care of. Sage brought the phone. That's what she was coming out for. She had brought the phone. And I forgot to end my video because I got distracted. My mind wanders and I forget what I'm doing. <laughs> I guess I'm probably the only one that does it out there. Anyway, I did go ahead and get myself ready for the day. And the noise that you hear is an airplane flying over. It's really loud. I'm sure you can hear it. I got Mr. Blade here with me. Blade, where are you going? Blade, what are you doing, buddy? <laughs> a sweet boy. He's got to lick me. Anyways, got my hair done, got my makeup on, ready for the day. Got to go in here and get school started. So I'm going to end today's vlog and probably start another one for tomorrow. And I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And if you're new here and haven't subscribed and you like my videos, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Join our YouTube family. We would love to have you join it. And until next time, bye.